are touching dirt. I'm in a whole nother uh, forest system today. Berry Creek MX Park. Yeah. Summer man David back there. Uh, I think we met through the Facebook on the TW 200 World page. And uh, he hit me up over the holidays, asked if I wanted to come down and come ride. We're down here between Mumsford and somethingville but I can't remember but all I see is all these different offshoots of dual sports or uh, actually enduro trails coming through the woods here but uh, yeah this is gonna be like I need to come back down here and check all this stuff out but we're gonna do a kind of a big lap Oakle-Gee Forest, I believe is what it's called. Oak and Glee and... Oh my gee, look at these little ponds and stuff. So it's going to be a nice little ride out here today. later definitely a good place for a navigational rally we're rooting through here today David hasn't ridden out here and I for sure haven't ridden out here but uh, there's just roads connecting all in here so this would be a awesome place for nighttime rally for navigational but man you can see the effects of the wind that Zeta storm has just knocked out so many trees here this year. Just a nice little cruise today. Get a little gravel. Oh, fresh gravel for the hill climb. Just a really 
really swampy, low-lying area here. Trails and trails and trails. Or I should say roads and roads and roads. I'm really curious about this uh, dual sport group that's down here. I posted it. They're having a dual sport ride in October 2021. I posted it in my events blog. This may be one I creep out to toward the end of the year. I may have to come down and check out some of their Enduros that they're putting out. I may come down and lend a helping hand. to the 183 I think what we'll do is is we'll go down to the 183 here hang her right and then just to the left there should be a drop off onto the other side and we can either go up toward trio or head the other way back where that bridge crosses over there's that little channel between the two sectors so all right we'll just we'll just kind of play it by ear I think we uh yeah this should be Matt more road and then we can just go down here and you good all right just creeping on creeping on all right on to another little dirt road here we'll see where this takes just put down tracks riding dirt roads or anything better to do on a sunday Woo, it's a chilly day i think it's like a high of 54 maybe but that wind's blowing it you can feel the chill. Yesterday was super nice. And then all of a sudden last night it just went back down to the low low. But today, nice and sunny. Cool, I'll take this. Oh, am I alone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's so much. You just spend days and days riding around out here. Little play pit. Burp, burp, burp. Huh. 
it's just so crazy all the little roads in here all this backwood i just still crack up on people living out you know people still uh it, this little route kind of does a loop it goes both ways but i think we may just go to the left and uh work our way back around it'll come out at the 219 and we can go down and drop across actually go across that that'll kind of set us up it's almost like maybe we make it all the way over there to where that bridge was because you've been to that bridge right yeah and then but you haven't done anything over here right no so that way you have uh you know you can say all right i've been you, you've been through the whole thing all right is the way. Dirt road touring today, man. It's kind of cool cruising through all these woods that I've never, I've never actually been in these. This is way south for me, but it's really cool to see all this out here. Look at this fence he's got going on, and he's got a hunting blind going on. That is one seriously serious fence. Ooh, yeah, he's putting in some work there. It's clear in his property back. Another hunting blind. up here so I'll clip you in off that point.
Yeah. <laughs> Down there, so. Oh yeah. Yeah, I saw that. I was like, all right, we'll go down there too and check that out. Yeah. But this is the bridge, right? Yep. So you've you've come from that way over there. Yeah, it's not too far. There's a neighborhood just beyond there. Oh really? And um in Centerville. Yeah. That the fence is new. Yeah, man. That was some serious property right there, huh? Yeah. It's like, who's that guy? Man, this is the uh, dirt road heaven down here. Just cruising all these little dirt roads, connecting up all through here. It's going to be interesting to go back and look at my uh, my route. Look at it on Google Maps. It's really cool. I'm at a. 52 miles so far and we're, uh, we made it to the bridge point in between the two sectors of the forest there's a bridge crossing and he had David ridden all the way up to that point so this is the section that he hadn't ridden on so For some reason that uh, property looks strangely familiar from one of the uh, YouTube videos I've been watching. This uh, farming guy, like homestead farmer guy, and uh, as soon as I saw that I'm like, oh yeah, I think I'm down in his area here. That may or may not have been his place. Maybe something I'll have to look at on my Google Maps. And if it is him, like heck man, I'll have to come back and visit him. That would be super rad. Alright, first obstacle here. I don't think the, uh, the truck's getting through that. Someone's tried to get through there. <laughs> Alright, so that means this route's not getting traveled on the regular. Cruising through, cruising through. It's crazy, you see all these different roads and trails, but they're not showing up on the the map but they could be you know by switching to satellite mode I'll see but for today's purposes we're just trying to put down some miles and just kind of make our way all through the woods without doing any real side shoots or anything because most likely they're just going to be uh, out and backs so we'll just stay on the roads that are going to actually take us through We've been kind of hopping over highways and trying to take these dirt roads as much as possible. But look at that! Oh, and close. Big marble gravels!
hunting club out here. Wow. And that one's a small one. You should have seen this other one. It's like a like a RV campground. But all had their permanent shelters over the RV so they could pull their truck underneath. to the main road. There's a big lake. And we're gonna hit pavement here for a second and on to another dirt road. <laughs> I dig it, dirt roads. Oh my goodness. Rally dirt roads. I gotta get my rally lights going, man. I need my nighttime rally act. There's a hunting club. wild huh yeah. I hear you frogs I hear you Another dirt road, I'll clip you in. Uh, <laughs> I'll wait. Let's see what this over the horizon looks like. Looks like we're coming out to the edge of something here. Could be a nice little overlook for you. If not, it's just a brrrr. I think it's just going to be a nice little burn. All right, in a minute. Nineteen hundred. So crazy when you're just uh, riding through the woods out here and you run up on a family cemetery. There's quite a lot of those out here based off of the families that own this land out here. And yet another little dirt road. Now the sign back there said uh, road closed 0.7 miles local locals only or local 
something, but I'm like, come on, man, like, you're gonna close a through road? We'll find out, though. We will find out. It's just, you know. Yeah, okay. Old school bridge. So, Holy Creek. Rebar on the wood. That's cool. It's just trying to keep the uh, through traffic out of there. And a little bit of a suspect bridge right there for regular cars. They don't want to say four wheel drive only. It's just interesting. How do they get like a such a big sign saying that the road's closed? I guess they could be like, ah, we're going to pay for it. This road shows going all the way through. So I'm here to investigate. It's closed, dang it. But we got special T dub permit. Woo! Slicky slicky. Somebody's been hotting it up on the road. beyond 0.7 of a mile. What the heck? huge canyon yeah, definitely uh, definitely getting washed away here all right it's like some it's like a giant sinkhole of some sort it's just faded away that might be a cause for road is closed all right continuing on Reach mud hole. Man, that's. Ooh. They just made it into their hunting camp. Dirt road, dirt road. Oh, the little dirt road. Hunting camp. Hunting camp, hunting camp, hunting camp. Hunting camps everywhere down here, man. Bridges. Another dirt road and another little dirt road. 
and another and another all kinds of little dirt roads we found a road that was going around to some old bridge but there were so many trees down over the road from the big storm that that was not going to be doable more dirt roadage more dirt roadage but look at these dirt roads over here it's like Whoa! look at the swoopy swoop going on on the dirt roads. <laughs> That's what I was doing back there. <laughs> Trying to get my glove on. The gloves don't work on the phones and I got a phone call, a robo call, uh.
only for this little bit. Most of the roads have been dirt. But, uh, nice little gravel section right here. For sure. it for today folks 83 miles majority of that dirt I cannot complain Seychelles. 